On July 29, 1999, a crazed cash-strapped day trader went on a shooting spree through two office buildings, killing nine workers and wounding 13 more. Meredith was shot in the back two months into her first job out of college. So the bullet hit my spine, intestines, my pancreas, and destroyed one of the two main veins of my heart. Meredith's doctors told her parents that her chances of survival were only one in 1,000. And had the shootings happened two days earlier, the region's blood supply would have been too low to save her. During the two emergency surgeries following the shooting, I needed 115 pints of blood. And so to put that into perspective, the human body holds about 10 to 12. She was so grateful for that life-saving blood that she began volunteering for the Red Cross a year later. But she had to wait 10 more years before doctors would clear her to donate blood. It was a big deal. You know, my husband came out and my parents were there and my two daughters were there. Ensuring that there's a, an adequate and safe blood supply is just very important to me because I know how important it is. And that one pint of blood can save the lives of up to three people. Meredith now serves as chair of the board of directors of the American Red Cross Southern Blood Services region. She hopes her survival story inspires others to donate right now at a time when she describes the need as dire.